Да не золотом аккуратнее, следи внимательно золотом. Is Denis Siplinkov not going hard enough on his trainings? Guys, I was watching the recent video that the Arm Olymp channel has posted here, and, you know, before posting their last video, they have posted one on where there's an update on Denis' health status, and Denis apparently caught a cold and couldn't train in the day of the recording. And now, on this new video, Dennis makes a comeback to the table after his time away, treating his cold. And Dennis' first sparring is against none other than the current heavyweight champion David Dadikyan. Wait, wait. In the start, David gains the center right from the go, and this slip sort of reminded me of the slip on round one from Devin vs. Dennis. Then the straps are applied, and we only have the footage of their sparring when it is right in the middle. Although, something that made think here for a while was the fact that, when Dadikian was going all out with his surges, having Dennis completely red while holding him, somebody comes up and tells David to slow it down and be careful. And when I saw that, I started thinking like, hey, isn't Dennis going to face Ermis this year still? Like, I know that Dennis just came back from his little cold he had, but for somebody to come up in the middle of their hard sparring to tell Dadikian to slow it down, it really shows how Dennis' training might not be the hardest that it could have been, right? Even because, Dennis was doing pretty well holding the heavyweight champion, and, he should have kept holding David's surges there. Because, there ain't gonna be nobody telling Ermes to slow it down when he faces Dennis. I even remember that I saw something equal to that when Zaur was sparring against Dennis. Zaur was going with his full surges, just completely pinning Dennis for reps. Then Babkin goes and asks Zaur to take it easy, and says that Dennis wasn't really able to arm wrestle properly at that time. Although, when Zauer went without his full speed, Dennis managed to hold him, and the same happens when Dadikian slow it down against Dennis. There's even a second round on where David gains center again, but this time, he don't let Dennis slip, and pins him right away. I know that Dennis might not be at his highest peak, but if he has Hermes as his next opponent, he certainly need to have the best training sessions to be in the very best that he can. Do you guys think the same? Leave down in the comments and thank you so much for watching.